Why is student well-being important? In crisis and post-crisis environments, caring for, protecting, and nurturing children is increasingly complex. The displacement, multiple losses, and violence that children often face in these contexts can negatively impact them socially and emotionally. Nevertheless, research indicates that the majority of children are resilient and therefore able to bounce back and recover if their basic needs are met and structures are put in place to support their social, emotional, cognitive, and physical development. What is the role of education in promoting student well-being? When children and youth experience chaos, uncertainty, and disruption, education can promote their well-being in many crucial ways. Learning environments can be structured spaces where children and youth feel a sense of safety, security, and hope. For those whose lives have been disrupted by crises, coming back to school is often seen as an opportunity for bringing communities together and reestablishing positive relationships. Schools help children and youth regain a sense of normalcy within a predictable and routine environment. Attending school at regular times on a regular basis can help children, youth, and their communities think positively about the future. What is the role of teachers in promoting student well-being? As important caregivers outside the home, teachers help children and youth recover and develop by creating classrooms that help students heal. Teachers can communicate life-saving messages and help students learn important academic and life skills by creating opportunities for students to cooperatively work and play together. They can encourage positive peer relationships where students can thrive and learn from one another. By establishing stable routines, teachers can promote feelings of control and predictability in the classroom. Teachers have the potential to serve as supportive adult figures who help students regain trust. What does student well-being look like as a result? As a result of teachers creating these healing classrooms, students may feel a sense of safety, security, and control in their lives, a sense of belonging and connection to the school community, and a sense of self-worth or self-confidence. They may be able to constructively and peacefully deal with conflict as they form positive relationships with their teachers and peers. They feel good about themselves as students and about their ability to learn. Ultimately, when students' social, emotional, and cognitive needs are met, they learn better and are far more likely to succeed in school.